All right, guys, welcome to today's workout. So this one is called the mace movement. So it's a flow workout. So a flow workout is where one exercise finishes, you start the next one. So there's four exercises in total. So you're gonna stay on that flow for seven minutes. Okay, once you've done your seven minutes, you're gonna take a 120 second rest, a two minute rest, and then you perform a second seven minute flow doing those same exercises. All right, guys, I'm gonna run you through the exercises now and we'll get into it. So the first one we're gonna do is a Bondi swing. Do our 360 swing. So we're gonna cast it over the shoulder, making sure you get full flexion in that swing, on that back swing. As it's coming around the body, I'm gonna have my thumb pointing down. Okay, and I'm gonna slide it along to the mace head and I'm gonna bring it down to the side of the body as I come into a squat and then from here, Keep the chest facing forward, straight line between the crown and the coccyx, drive up from the heels, squeeze the glutes as I throw that mace head back up. I'm gonna switch hands, so I bring this hand to the bottom. I do a 360, single 360 over the other side. Again, thumb pointing down, and then catch it on the other side. So I'll just do a few reps of those, show you what that looks like. So we'll do our Bondi swing. We're gonna do a 360 into a prayer. We're gonna do our 360. As it's coming around, it's coming across my right shoulder, I'm gonna catch it in my left hand. Okay, so palm facing up. I'm gonna step back with my left leg. I'm gonna push this down into the ground. With this hand, I'm gonna put it upwards. So ripping that mace apart into the lunge. I step forward, and now I'm gonna cast the mace head up on the other direction catch it with the other hand. So we do a two-handed 360 as it's coming around. I'll bring this hand off, catch it into the prayer on the other side, and we repeat that movement. So I'll show you what that looks like. Okay, the next exercise we're gonna do is a two-handed arm cast into flag press. It is a more of a club exercise, but I like to do this with a mace as well, just because you've got that longer leverage. It makes it very interesting exercise to put in with your mace workouts as well. So setting up in that rack position, elbows are tucked in, hands are on the navel. We're gonna do our two-handed arm cast. Okay, so keeping those elbows tucked in to the ears as you're bringing it all the way back behind the head, making sure that your thumb reaches your t-shirt line so your triceps are in full flexion we're going to bring that over the head so rip down from those lats pull down from the elbows and then we're going to drive forward and up again we're driving from the navel to the shoulders so we're pushing forward and up at the same time when i do my presses i'm squeezing through the chest and draw those elbows in as i drive forward and the next one we're going to go into is a two-handed rotational meal if i'm doing any type of lateral movement with a mace, always gotta make sure that you choke up on that handle so you don't crack your feet. Okay, so just gonna bring it six inches off the floor, bring the other hand over top, just gonna clean that into the styling position. So your two-handed mill is basically cast, full arm lock, swing to the other side. If I'm swinging and it's coming in from my right hand side, I wanna do a 360 over my left shoulder. Okay, so I'll show you what that looks like. So we're gonna do a cast, as it's coming from this side, comes in over my left shoulder, do our 360 swing, and then we cast away again. All right, guys, I'm gonna put that together as a flow now. Okay, so we're gonna do our Bondi swing. So Bondi swing. Other side. Two-handed 360, prayer transition. Other side. Okay, flowing it back up. Two-handed arm cast into flag press. 200 mil, and another side, and then we go again. Bondi swing, Bondi swing, 360, prayer, 360, prayer, arm cast, flag press, 200 mil. Two hand a meal, and then we go again. So just complete that flow as many times as you can in seven minutes. Take a two minute rest, then get a second set in. All right, guys, that's it for today's workout. I hope you enjoy. 
and I'll see you in the next one. Hey guys, thanks for checking out this video. If you want more videos just like this one, be sure to subscribe to our channel. And if you wanna check out our dangerously fit strength training equipment, all of our products are available on Amazon and through our websites. I'll leave the links in the description below. Thanks again for watching the video and I'll see you in the next one.